Shiba Inu fam, last night, SHIB saw a bit of a sell-off, just like the rest of the market. So this is obviously not surprising. Bitcoin sold off, Cardano sold off. Everything right now is moving together. And that's the way that it's been for a lot of this bear market cycle that we're in. Now, that being said, there are a couple things that are ahead of us over these next few days. And it seems like this move here was just kind of in anticipation of that. People don't know, obviously, what things are going to look like. But starting tomorrow, we have the FOMC meeting. So this is obviously where they're going to decide how much they want to raise interest rates. So this is obviously directly going to affect the market and Shiba Inu as well. Shiba Inu is going to move with the market. Now, that being said, the four previous cycles, they or four previous meetings, they raised interest rates 75 basis points. So four consecutive periods. Now, this one's expected to be a little bit different, a little bit of an easing period that is going to be supposedly going on. The whole market is set and prepared for 50 basis points. That is what has been talked about all over the place. That's what I think we're going to get as well. Obviously, we don't know until it comes out. But if we do get 50 basis points, chances are the markets are probably going to handle that well, probably going to recover a little bit. We may get a little bit of a knee jerk you know, reaction right away. That's what has typically happened. But then we may start to see some sort of rally out of that. So just be prepared if that does happen. As always, this is not financial advice. Now, after the conclusion of this meeting on the 14th, which is the date that they'll make the announcement, we have CPI report right on the 15th, very next day. That's the rolling 12-month period of how inflation is doing. And the last period that we saw, last report that we saw, we actually saw inflation come down a half a percentage point, which is the biggest drop that we had over the course of 2022, especially since we saw the you know inflation hit the heights that it did. Now, what is expected this period? I don't know. I haven't seen the reports or the writings, anything yet. I think most most uh, outlets and people are, are more so worried about the FOMC meeting right now, which to be fair, that's fine, right? I think both of these are going to have a, an impact on you know, the price of crypto, the price of Shiba Inu. But if this comes back similar to what we had in the last report, like another almost half a percent of inflation coming down, I think that'd be huge for the market. I think the market would see that as a very big key to the start of recovery. Now, I'm not saying that we're out of the bear market yet. You know, Even if we do get a kind of a recovery rally, I don't know if that's the end of it yet. We probably still got some more downside. But what is good is there's going to be more inflation rolling off as we move forward into 2023. I know that, I, I believe it's in February and March, we're gonna have the biggest two drop-offs from the previous 12 months. That's where we really saw inflation ramp up over the course of 2022. That's the time when it really got so bad. The great thing now is with the interest rate hikes they've been doing, the government has at least stopped printing big bills. Okay, That's not how you combat inflation. You don't print a bunch of money, Okay, especially when you're raising interest rates. But that's just, that's my gripe, right? I digress. But these things are going to directly impact Shiba Inu price. Okay, Shiba Inu is obviously tied in with the market. And right now, it's it's kind of just stuck there, right? It's stuck moving with Bitcoin. All the advancements that Shiba Inu is doing, the growth that it's making in its ecosystem isn't going to really affect it much right now. Even if it came out and said, oh yeah, the SHIB Metaverse launched tomorrow, we may not get much of a move, okay? That's just the victim of its circumstance right now, okay? It's stuck in this bear market. Now, the great thing is, is that Shiba Inu continues to develop during these times where prices are down, where prices are affected by the macro factors, okay? But that's all I really got for you guys in this one. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Make sure you guys are aware of what is going on over those next few days. Very, very important. Uh, make sure you guys watch uh, all the outlets. I believe the FOMC announcement is going to be later in the day on or in the afternoon on the 14th. And CPI data comes out at 8.30 a.m. Eastern time on what? The 15th. That'd be Thursday, right? Thursday. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> so hope you guys have a great day. Really hope to catch you in the next one. Take care.